Hey, this one. Welcome back to the episode of Is in Warping. So this episode this pool a missing product. And basically what this is, is a hanging storage organizer. So you can actually put your clothes, your underwear, whatever you want to put in here, that's up to you guys. But this is basically what the packaging looks like. And this is from the brand called Storage Work. So first thing first, we're actually open the product to show you guys what's actually included inside first. When we open up, you can see that this is basically what the package looks like. So you basically get the part right here, and that is everything that's inside. So let me actually open this up to show you guys what it actually looks like. All right, so this is what looks like in the front. This is what looks on the side, and here's the back. So let's open up this part here and show you guys what the part looks like. All right, so this is basically what looks like on the top part here. If you can see, they have the sticky part right here. They want to stick the Velcro on top right here. But this will also give you guys the hook option. So that way you guys have extra support as well to hold everything that's in here. So that's really cool how they provide you guys that option right there. But basically all you gotta do is just hang this somewhere and this whole entire thing will actually expand. And there's actually different sections here. So let me actually stand up and expand it and show you guys what it looks like. All right, so if I just hold it on top part right here and just let go, you guys can see what happens. All right, so you definitely see there's a lot of different compartments on here. So there's one here, two, three, four, five, and six. Six different compartments right here for you guys to put whatever you guys want. And the material on here is actually pretty high quality. You guys can see right there. It's definitely really sturdy and the material of the fabric right here is pretty high quality as well. When we look at the side right here, you can see there's some pockets. So there's one pocket here, there's one pocket here. And the material that they use for the pocket right here is like a mesh material, so it's actually breathable. So if you guys put like hot stuff on here, it definitely works really, really well. But this is basically what the overall pile looks like once you guys fully expand it, if you guys can see. So let me actually bring this over to the closet and hang this to show you guys what it actually looks like. And then we can probably put some stuff inside each section to show you guys how much space is inside. All right, so you can see that once we have the pile all set up, this is basically what it actually looks like. So you definitely have a lot of space for you guys to put stuff here, 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 and here. Like I mentioned on the slide, you can definitely put stuff on the mesh bags right here. And then on the top part, we have it set up like this. So if you guys want to use this option, you can definitely do that. Otherwise, you can use this option as well. So the way how you use the hook option is just by loosening this up and don't use this at all. So if you can see right now, we're only using the hook option to actually hold it up. So you can definitely use this option or you can use the Velcro option. Whichever one you guys decide to use, that's up to you guys. But you cannot use both at the same time because of the way how to design it. So that's actually really cool. So that way, if you guys have like wear and tears on this hook option, then you guys can use the Velcro. Or you guys can do vice versa and just use the Velcro first. Then over time, if the Velcro has wear and tears, then you guys can just use the hook option. But regardless of which one you guys use, that is up to you guys. Both of them will give you guys the option to move it left and right like this if you guys want to. So this is basically what it looks like once you guys fully set it up, if you guys can see. And then on the other side right here, I already have one all set up. I actually really like this a lot. This one has all like the drawers and everything. This one does not. But the good thing about this one that does not have the drawer is the fact that they have all this space for you guys to put whatever you guys want. You don't have to worry about putting like a drawer or a box or whatever. Even though having a drawer option is pretty nice. So that way you can keep everything all organized and you guys know where everything is. You can definitely put whatever you guys want in here. You can put like your laundry, your clothes, your towels, underwear, whatever you guys want to put in here that's up to you guys. But definitely a very nice hybrid option where you guys can use the hook option or you can use the Velcro option right here if you guys can see. And welcome back guys. So now you guys saw a quick test on our product, you can definitely see it actually works really, really well. I definitely love how they give you guys the option to either use the Velcro option or the ring option, so that way you get extra support. Not like a regular organizer where they only give you guys the Velcro option to actually stick on, and no hooks to actually give you guys the extra support. This is actually really cool how they give you guys the option. And because of the storage organizer is foldable, you guys actually fold it back up, and you guys can bring it on the go if you guys are moving or traveling or going somewhere else which is super awesome. But now that we're unboxing and testing out the product, now to answer the question of whether or not it's actually worth or not. So for this product in particular, I definitely have to say that it is pretty worth it if you guys want one or need one of these, especially if you guys want to save space and try to put as much stuff as possible into one section or one area. But then obviously for those guys who don't want or don't need one or have to use one of these, then obviously don't buy one and save your money for something else that actually do need. So that's basically everything for this video itself. If you guys like this video, make sure to smash that like button in the bottom. That will definitely help this video out. And it will definitely help with the algorithm as well to promote more videos for you guys so you guys can see more of the videos or similar videos as well. But as always, make sure to stay positive, be you, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Is It Worth It? Peace.